Hello, uh, in this small video I will show how to totally delete uh, AdBlue at the modern Mercedes GLC with a uh, four-cylinder engine. And then what we have here now, the check uh, AdBlue message. And uh, there are several faults at the uh, SCR uh, system. Uh, uh, particularly in that car, it is a heater, AdBlue heater is uh, defective. So, um, first of all, uh, I will show how we will fix this with simple OBD2 plug. So first we, uh, we switch ACC to position 2, but do not start engine. And uh, then I use with uh, simple OBD2 plug first to uh, do reset of that message. Uh, and uh, actually I will do that reset. And then I will, uh, on the second stage, I will totally delete the elbow from that car with, again, with simple OBD2 plug. No wire, cut, nothing. So uh, first, I plug this to the OBD diagnostic, and then I will observe the uh, uh, audio uh, screen messages. So now it's plugged, and let's see what we do have here. So there are several presets. I will rotating the uh, controller left and right, and pressing it down to confirm. So first, uh, at this, the first, uh, there are several presets here. So first is uh, at blue limit reset. And the second one is the factory firmware. Uh, this is on blue delete. And I have even uh, chip tuning uh, firmware here. So we'll start with uh, at blue limit reset. I'm confirming now. And this is necessary uh, to, uh, to block, to, to erase the uh, motor block situation. And uh, I recommend to do it anyway before you will uh, totally delete the at blue. So this is the sequence number one. It just to uh, reset the um, possible problems that the uh, car already has. So uh, okay, I'm switch uh, ACC off now. ACC is off. Then let's see. Okay, let's switch it on again. Again, switch off again, switch off again. I need to do it sequence two times. Okay, switch back on. Okay, successfully finished, remove the model. I will remove in the model, okay. We still have the message because we didn't fix any. We just reset the motor start. So let, let's let's check. So motor is okay. I I I, I can uh, start motor. This is good. Now I, I again I switch ACC to position two and then I plug this one more time. And this time I will select uh, the add blue delete uh, script. Okay, let's see. Okay, okay, I will select this at blue and confirm now. ACC position 2. And I'm confirming with pressing the knob down. Okay, I'm confirming and it starts to delete. It takes near 2 minutes and then it's done. So it started. And I do recommend before uh, you will start to the add blue delete, uh, physically disconnect the uh, SCR control unit and the knock sensors, uh, as the as uh, defective uh, items may cause some uh, DTC. So uh, before you do the, or you can do it after. It doesn't matter. Because uh, after uh, this at blue delete, the STR control unit and knock sensors is not necessary anymore. You don't need to refill at blue. 
And what is important with, uh, with uh, our OBD2 plug? Any time in two minutes, you can revert to the factory settings. And for any reason, I, I don't know, what, uh, warranty uh, cases and uh, or whatever, you can, in two minutes, you can revert to the uh, factory firmware and then connect back a SR control unit, knock sensors, and you will have the factory setup. You don't need to go anywhere. You can do it yourself anytime you want. Just keep the plug uh, at the car and you can do it anytime. Okay, now it's finished. At blue deleted, you just ask to switch ACC off to reboot the motor control unit. Okay, I'm switching ACC back on now. And finished. Voila. So I'm removing the model. Model is here. I keep this in the car. And what do we have? There is no messages. Let's start. Uh, let's test to start engine. So radar sensors are dirty, but it does not matter. Anyway, uh, you see, there is no hot blue problem at that car anymore. So uh, hope you like it. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.